what if i tell you that you can logically predict the difficulty level of cat 2022 what would your answer be well some of you may say that it's bullshit but the reality is that you can do it you can actually make a very safe and a logical assumption of what you can expect in cat 2022 and this video is about to tell you that what is going to be what is my logical assumption of what is going to be the difficulty level of cat 2022 will it be extremely tough will it be extremely easy or will it be the same as cat 2021 we'll find this out in this video hi i am darpan saxena an mba graduate from iim udaipur and let's get on with the video now if you watched my last video in which i gave you a 30 day plan for your cat 2022 a 30 day strategy a revision strategy for cat 2022 then you would know exactly that i've already spoken about this when i was speaking to that okay what as per me is going to be the lod the level of difficulty for cat 2022 and i said to you that you know what my assumption is what my very logical and calculated assumption for cat 2022 is that the lod is going to be pretty much the same now obviously i cannot predict this but i can and you know as well as you can i can make a very logical and a very safe assumption of why am i saying that the lod for cat 2022 is going to be the same as cat 2021 uh, and why is it even important for you to know that what the lod is so first of all i like to say to you that okay is it important for you to even know what is going to be the lod of this year's cat well the answer is that no it's not important even if the actual cat day you realize that the cat is very tough even then it does not make any difference to you because it will be the same for everyone However, the reason why I'm still creating this is that in your mind, you always need to create a anchor point and that anchor point of what you can expect of what you can anticipate in 2022 uh, is that you can assume it that on a good day, on a fine day, it will be the same as what it was in CAT 2021. Now, without further or do i will quickly explain that why am i saying this with absolute data and logic now i'll share with you something very interesting in uh, you know uh, on your screen and this is what it is i have compiled some data for the last few years of the cat and what you need to see here is that i have compiled it for the number of questions which have appeared each year what has been the raw score for 99 percentile what has been the total score which is which is obviously the number of questions into three what is you know what hence is the percentage score for which you would get a 99 percentile in cat overall in that year and what was the duration of the exam and also something for you to know that which i am had conducted that year's cat now, what you need to focus on primarily, if I were to say, you need to focus on this particular column. Let me just put it with a different color. I'm trying to put it with a different color very quickly so that you can understand this really well. And here it is. This one. Now, the reason why I'm saying this, that CAT 2022 will be the same or will have the same LOD as 20 or uh, 21 is one very simple thing. There is a very simple uh, thumb rule which you need to know about. And what exactly is that? The thumb rule which I'm saying to you is that there will be a change in LOD most likely only when there is a change in the pattern of the exam. So if the pattern of the cat has been the same then you can safely assume that the lod is also going to be the same and i will be sharing it with you with my data that why am i uh, saying this so as you can now see in front of your screen that in this entire sheet which i have the first time when the pattern had changed was in cat 2014 if you can see over here cat 2014 is the first time when the duration of the exam had changed it had slightly increased 
now while i have not been able to find this value for cat 2013 but since i was a mba aspirant in cat 20 uh, 14 and since I knew that what the CAT 2013 exam was like since we used to study as per that exam in our head I can tell you for a fact that the that the LOD of CAT 2013 CAT 2012 and even CAT 2011 was very high the paper was not e the paper was not easy it was very it used to be very difficult the LOD was very high and suddenly, suddenly, when you see that the exam structure changed, when the CAT pattern had changed, even slightly, what happened is that, and also what you need to see is that this had also changed. So while the exam increased by half an hour, the, you know, also the number of questions also had increased. With this pattern change, when I was a aspirant attempting CAT in 2014, I realized that CAT was much easier than what I had studied for which is what you can see that for you to score a 99 percentile in that easy exam you had to score a very high percentage score so hence again what you can see is that only when there was a change in score there was a change in the LOD now again what you will see is that further from 2014 again the exam structure had changed in 2015 and now only the hours of the exam had changed now when the hours of, of the exam had changed and also the structure of the exam had changed what happened was that again you would see that the LOD of the exam also changed now the exam became slightly tough and as you can see that for as long as the pattern remained the same, which is from 2015 to 2019, you can see that the LOD also remained fairly the same. It was very similar. So you knew for a fact that for you to get a 99 percentile in CAT in any of the years, approximately you had to get a 50 to 55 percent of, of the raw score. That was the broad idea. And again, you can see that when the structure of the exam had changed again, that the hours were dropped due to the ongoing the pandemic, which was happening at that particular time. And also the number of questions had dropped. Then you could see that the exam became slightly more difficult as the percentage score to score the same amount of percentile had dropped and again it has remained the same in the last two years when the structure of the exam has broadly remained the same the point is the point being the point being that for as long as the structure of the exam will be the same you can safely expect that the LOD will be the same whereas whenever there is a change in in the structure you can safely assume again that there will be a change in the lod so from here you can safely see you can safely assume that the lod is expected to be the uh, same now if you're interested to know about what are my thoughts about the sectional lod that will qa be the same or easier or higher or all of that things i will be creating separate videos for all of these do watch it do like and subscribe so that you know whenever i post a new video to help you in these final few days of your cat prep in my next video what i'll be speaking to you about is that if you are somebody who's weak in qa and how exactly you can score a very high percentile and 99 percentile in qa even if you are weak in it that is what i'll be speaking to you up next in my next video thanks a lot and goodbye